So hello guys, welcome back to the channel Arbaz here. In this video, I will be showing you uh, the new features which I added into the AI that plays GTA San Andreas. So uh, now I have added a gesture control to this uh, uh, game. So what uh, uh, this does is, so I created two different scripts. So one script is for controlling the game. So uh, I will be making another video about how you can send the inputs to this uh, game so there will be a separate video on that topic uh, coming soon but uh, in this video i will be showing you uh, the gesture control so uh, for that i used opencv and uh, uh, some other libraries so i will be showing that in the different video uh, but in just uh, in this video i will be just showing you uh, how this gesture control works so if i uh, show uh, my fingers to this gesture control thing so it uses my webcam for this so as you can see uh, it is showing some uh, output on the screen as you can see it is showing backward forward left right so uh, if i uh, give it five fingers so it, it will stop if i show four fingers so it will uh, turn right and if i show three fingers so it will turn left and if i show it uh, two fingers so it will go backwards so uh, i think there is some uh, issue with it so recognizing my fingers so as you can see if they are close it is uh, recognizing better so it will go backwards and if i show one finger so it will go forward so uh, this thing will work uh, with the gts and andreas so let me just uh, move to my game screen and show you so oh. yeah so yeah. now we have moved to our game screen and as you can see here is our uh, game character so let me just find a car for us and we will try to drive that car using this gesture recognition So guys as you can see I am in a car now so let me just uh, give it some inputs so we will first try to move it forward so uh, I am showing it my one finger so it is trying to move forward so I think uh, it is not able to recognize my finger so as you can see on the screen so let me move uh, backwards so as you can see it is now moving backwards and now what we will try is uh, like move it uh, left so as you can see it is moving left now and let's move uh, backwards and move even left and let's just try to uh, drive this vehicle on the road so i will also make some turns so we will stop the car here so as you can see it has stopped the car and let me move it backwards and now we will move it forward so Okay, the car is stuck somewhere, so let me try to let's try uh, let's find some other place where we can drive this car. So let me just try to take it somewhere we can drive it easily. So 
So now we will try to uh, just drive this car here. As you guys can see on the screen, uh, it is recognizing my hand with my five fingers, so it is, uh, it is stopping the car. And if I show it one finger, so it will move forward. If I show it two fingers, so it will move backward. If I show it three fingers, so it will turn left. And if I show it uh, four fingers, so it will turn right. So let's just try to make it on track. And now we will turn left. Now we will turn right. So let me just uh, bring it backwards. Okay. So as you guys can see, it is able to drive the car. So. That was it for this video. So in the next video, I'll be showing you how you can do this for your own game. And we can use this same script and run it on GTA 5 and Vice City also. So it is compatible with all GTA games. 
so if you want to try this and if you have any other suggestions uh, to improve this so i will leave the link to the github repo in the description of this video so you can go there and see the code and make some changes and try it yourself if you are not subscribed to our channel so please make sure you subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to get notified when i post new videos thanks for watching the video i will see you in the next one